Okay, and this job starts so that we have to be one good quality steel vice like workbench where we can install this my diesel fuel injector and in like this Toyota case this is Densos we can see in there this product code number in here we can install this my fuel injector in this position where are this steel cut shape shape these plane positions where are those in Densos things this product code in here and now I install this my injector in in this way in this way and then I tight carefully this my steel vise and especially look that area this must be to be solid when I compress that in this way and there is this my steel vise and I, now it's it tight in here and then there is one nut in that area. This nut and bolt in here. This is like this locking bolt. And now I need wrench. What size is this 14 millimeter? And now when I install this my tool in here and I start to rotate in this way. This way, this is like anti-clockwise, I can take out this cover and remember that now when we take these parts away, we have to be really carefully that we remember that in what position these inner parts are and that's I recommend that we install uh, my finger that I compress these parts in down and now I rotate this cover away with a little bit. This is easy to rotate because maker is Toyota. And now I carefully I remove these all parts. And look, this is like hole and hollow. This is good to check that it is good. And, and now we can see in that area that there is this first this diesel fuel injectors this spray part and then when I carefully I lift up these parts we can look this closer remember that we have to carefully remember that in what parts these positions are because they are just in really important that these parts go just in same way back. And this is really critical. When we look in here, there is one part in this inner area and I can take this part away in here in this way. And then especially this next part that there are two pins that they are just in this position. Remember? And we have to check that and notice that these parts are movable. And then there is again one part. And now we go to look these parts a little bit closer. Now I install this back in, in this way. And they goes nicely. And now I rotate that little bit. And now they are loosened. And now we can go to look these parts closer. Okay, and now we are in here area and now I can take this outer cover away carefully and now I drop these parts in here and every part must be just in same position and in here this first part when I take this inner part away there is this small needle and this part is this critical part when our diesel engine is running this part goes 
it closes and opens this diesel injectors, these small holes in here. And this is this part what moves in every engine run in open and close. And now it's open and when it goes in here, now this injectors head, this is close. And now I take that needle away. And then we can look also this part, because this part, there are two those movable locking pins, and in here we have this magnetic, this electric, this spring, and this bolt, what moves in here when we have electricity. And this electricity comes in these connectors in here and it moves this part up and down in this way. And then in same position this my needle moves and open and close this fuel injectors, this most important nose where are those diesel gasoline, this fuels, holes, and we can see when we have really good sign and bigger view that there are inside in here, in that area, small holes. And how we can see that there are really those holes, we need for that purpose now specific spray. And I go to take my spray. We need to purchase now air intake and throttle valve, valve cleaner spray. And now when I install this my head in inside in here, in this way we can check that how this my diesel injector is working. And in here we can see soon that the spray is going out. In that way. Very nicely. And we can look this closer because in that way we can check that how this our fuel injector is really working. Because sometimes these holes they can be stuck and like there is really bad jam in there. And now we can see really nicely that how when I press this my spray cleaner that how there goes this small spray out. And this is my cleaner and this my nozzle is working really well. In this way we can see that how well the spray is going out in all holes. Look, excellent work. Excellent work. And now I believe that this my small holes in there, they are clean and they are so small in this nozzle that we can see only when we compress in there this, this cleaner in here. And this is this purpose how we can check and inspect our diesel fuel injector status in our diesel engines. Okay, and this is important thing and this was this my video and thumbs up my friend and see you in next movie.